going on everybody it's titanium feet jack and i'm back at you again with another video i'd like to welcome you guys back to the channel there's a list of my socials down below if you want to continue to follow me on my socials as well as follow me here on youtube as well and to help keep up with that i need you to sub up to the channel if you haven't already and hit those notification bells so you'll be notified every time i drop a video on this channel and if you're feeling the shoe that we're looking at today I need you to hit that like button and also leave a comment and let me know what your thoughts are on today's sneaker and another way you can keep up with me is in the family vibes discord group here's the instagram page any questions about it or you would like to you know get involved with it you can message the account that's right here on the screen the instagram account message that account and someone will get back to you and help you out to join if you like to or you can message me myself and we'll get you squared away so we can lighten that load on you getting the sneakers that you covered for retail or very close to it now today we got an early review we take a look at a sneaker and it's for the ladies so shout out to jasmine jordan another one of her collaborations here's the look at the box we got a white jordan box gold jordan jump man nothing much to the box another gold jordan jump man and here is the box label i'm gonna read it aloud to you it says women's air jordan 11 retro color midnight navy metallic silver and this is a size eight and a half in women and the retail price is gonna be like 225 uh, I'm assuming that's because of the materials. Here's a look at the box top. There is no box stamp. And we see the white paper with the gold 23s all over. And that's all we have in the box. Let's bring on the sneakers. Here we go guys, the Air Jordan Retro 11 Midnight Navy Velvet. And yes, it does remind you of that uh, burgundy one that came out a few years ago i had a few pairs of those uh that was a women's shoe it really didn't gain much popularity but you know it's another women's sneaking out this one this one is a little better i can kind of dig this and if it did come in extended sizes uh no i wouldn't get a pair or if i did i have to get the velvet traded out for something else but Let's get started with the review. We have a very soft new buck material right here on your upper. Then you got your six uh, eyelets with nylon material that uh, is pretty much on every Jordan Retro 11. And you got some of that soft new buck going on right here. You have your metallic silver Jordan Jumpman right there. Then where the patent leather normally be on your Retro 11s, we have some velvet. Yes, velvet, midnight navy velvet going on the toe box in the side. And looking at the midsole, we have white here with the midnight navy in the translucent form. And it leads to the outsole. This is your outsole. Midnight navy outsole is translucent, so you should be able to see through it as well. And we have the herringbone traction right here on the heel and the midfoot in that midnight navy colorway solid and there is a jordan jump man in here and you can see that carbon fiber right there looking at the heel we have a 23 and this screen printed on per se and uh metallic silver on the back heel tab then looking at the medial side of the sneaker more of that nice soft new buck on your upper and you have that midnight navy blue velvet going around here on the side same white midsole with midnight navy translucent on the very bottom and there you go better look at that carbon fiber gotta pluck it and looking at your toe box to show you how thick the suede is is it changing color yes it is changing color so it's a thick suede and I'm, I'm saying suede i'm sorry guys this is velvet a very thick velvet and it comes with one set of laces the midnight navy rope laces and we do have some midnight navy tips metal tips on the uh 
laces. And this is the only set of laces it come with. And looking at the tongue, you have that nice soft new buck tongue. And you have the uh, patch right here that says Jumpman Jordan with the Jumpman logo in the middle of it. Nothing on the tongue as usual. And on the other side, you have a woven patch in the Midnight Navy colorway. And you can see that quality products, you know, quality basketball products inspired by the greatest player ever. And we know who that is. Come stuff with paper right there. And look on the inside, we have a Midnight Navy sock liner, kind of soft, satin family satin material family and we have a midnight navy insert I'm trying to see if i could get that jordan jump man to show yep jordan jump man in here any midnight i'm sorry it's uh in the white colorway let's see if the insert come out yep the insert slides right on now guys there you go better look at that insert Look on the back, Air Jordan 11, QF-8H as in Hotel, MS-7B as in Bravo. So that is a look at the uh, women's Jordan 11 Retro Midnight Navy. Let me know your comments on these. Let me know your plans. Are you trying to get these on release day? I was able to secure these on the Nike sneakers at Shock Drop. Shout out to the Family Vibes Discord group. Got that early notification, so I was able to prepare myself to get on. So, that's the sneaker. It releases next month, sometime in November, but drop in the comment section like I asked if you plan to get this sneaker and share your thoughts on this sneaker. And before I go, like I always tell you, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker because you never know. But it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack, signing out.